this tastes like smoked Gouda. You ever been to a party and you accidentally pick up that beer that people were using as an ashtray and you take a sip? Yeah, that kind of flavor is a style of beer. People actually like smoked beers. They like drinking ash and cigarettes. That's why I think it's the worst style of beer, but I'm a fair person and I'll give everything a try. So today I got three different smoked beers, one imported, one from a brewery that's pretty good, and one from another brewery that has actually won awards for their smoked beers. So I'm gonna give it a try. Wish me luck. First up, straight from Germany, we got a Marzen Rochbeer, rock beer, smoke beer. Let's bust into it. Ooh, it smells like smoked bacon. Cheers. It's smoky. This is a campfire. This is like I took the grease from my smoker after smoking a ham. It's not very good. You're only proving my point here, guys. Stop using smoked malts, stop using peated malts. It doesn't taste good. Let's try the next one. Next up, we've got coffee and cigarettes, a smoked porter. Now, doesn't that sound delicious? Let's dig in. Well, this is a foamy boy. It smells like coffee. It smells like over roasted coffee. Like you burnt your coffee in the morning when you were making it. Cheers. It tastes like a cigarette. It ain't, it's pretty gross, honestly. Um, I feel like this beer is targeting people that eat their cigarette butts after they're done smoking. I, I just don't understand what coffee and cigarettes appeals to anybody. Is, is that really something that I'm missing out on? Regardless, this beer does not taste very good. And it's just adding to the point of, this may actually be the worst beer style ever. Let's go to the next one. Last up, and if any beer is gonna be a winner, it's gonna be this one. This is from Figaro Mountain, who has won awards for their smoked beers. It's their 12th anniversary. It's a smoked eyes bock. It comes out at 13.5%. Here's to open. I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to get this thing open. There's so much freaking wax on it. Look at this shit. Wax beers are annoying to do, and they're just as annoying to open. Oh, victory. Let's pop this bad boy up. Okay. This one is much lighter than the other two. It's actually got a good red color. It smells like smoke. Ooh, baby. This tastes like smoked Gouda. It is like a good smoked cheese, but I don't like it in a beer. It does not taste good as a drink. Now, I'm sure there are plenty of people out there that like to liquefy their cheese and just slurp it on down. That's what this is. You want some smoked Gouda? You wanna chuck it into the microwave and just lick it off the plate? This is for you, it ain't for me. This was the best of the three. Still not very good. <laughs> well, Figueroa Mountain, you tried. Valiant effort, still failed me. Well, we got smoked ham, spent coffee grounds and ashtray and smoked cheese. Now, I think that these have just proven to me that this is the worst beer style around. I'm a brewer at heart, I love to give everything a try, but these do not work for me. If you love those flavors, good on you. You can be the one that starts supporting these. Now, I just want to say, this these were really hard to find. I had to go out of my way and get one of these shipped to me just to be able to find some smoke beers because they just don't exist. And that's probably for a good reason. So, thanks for tuning in and watching me suffer. If you enjoyed the video, Please like and subscribe. It really supports the channel. I'm Sudsy Sam. Don't forget to keep it Sudsy, and I'll see you next time.